China's terrifying oil discovery that will change the world. Now, China, which has 61 drilling platforms, just announced its terrifying new oil discovery that will change the entire world forever. With over a billion people requiring fuel goods, China has traditionally been one of the leading participants in the import of oil and gas around the world. However, a new discovery of crude oil by China has the potential to not only tilt the regional oil price scales, but also have an impact on the direction of oil and gas products globally. Despite having a demand for more than 800 million tons of oil annually, China has historically had some success in its development of oil fields, but these fields are typically exhausted with little to no significant exports. However, the biggest oil and gas producer in China, Sinopec, has made a finding that might alter China's perception of its future crude oil consumption. There is usually a negative perception associated with drilling for oil and natural gas in the water. There are many reasons to believe it is, overall, good for the nation, though. Offshore drilling may result in more economic activity, a boost to one's reputation abroad, and environmental advantages. The continuation of financial investments in domestic oil production is also necessary for this. Now, China, which has 61 drilling platforms, has just unveiled its terrible new oil discovery that could alter the course of human history forever. By locating the first significant deep water, deep stratum gas field in China, scientists have achieved a significant scientific milestone. A gas field with confirmed reserves of over 50 billion cubic meters is located in the sea southeast of Hainan province. In the government's efforts to expedite deep sea exploration, this represents a significant advancement, and keeping its energy independence depends on doing this. Bao Dao 21 1. The new gas field will be known as Bao Dao 21 1 according to a statement made by the China National Offshore Oil Corporation, or CNUC. It was also the biggest development in drilling in the Songnan Baodao region in approximately 50 years. Offshore oil and gas exploration frequently concentrates on deep water, or waters deeper than 300 meters. Additionally, deep wells are defined as being deeper than 3,000 meters. The Baodao 21-1 gas field, according to analysts, is situated southeast of Hainan Island, in a deep ocean location. It has a finished well depth of more than 5,000 meters and is capable of operating at depths of more than 1,500 meters. And as a result of these circumstances, it is exposed to extremely difficult marine geological conditions. The Baodao sag has the potential to be further explored as stated by Sinuk, Hainan's head geologist Wu Keqiang. The fact that China has made a sizable technological advancement in the field of deep water drilling was also mentioned by the speaker. Moreover, scientists claim that it has significant ramifications for discovering more formations of this nature. China's deep sea and deep earth exploration of technology is allegedly among the greatest in the world, according to Lin Bokiang, director of Zaimen University's Center for Energy Economics Research. This discovery will, in her opinion, hasten the development of similar exploration tools, she claims. Furthermore, it provides a potential stage for the nation to demonstrate its cutting-edge technological capability. Lin also said that the recently found gas field would help secure China's energy supplies. This strategy will ensure that the government can meet the increased energy needs of its citizens, even as natural gas prices around the world continue to rise. According to Sinuk, the distance between Deep Sea No. 1, a Chinese ultra-deep water gas deposit, and Baodao 21-1 is around 150 kilometers. Moreover, a news outlet reports that since Deep Sea No. 1 began operations on June 25, 2021, it has taken out more than 2 billion cubic meters of natural gas. Why is China creating so many offshore oil rigs then? Of course, oil rigs are beneficial to the economy and the job sector. And the benefits of a booming oil market will start to benefit the entire planet. Transport, shipping, and other modes of mobility are essential for a nation the size of China. 
Additionally, decreased market prices for oil and gas have an impact on other sectors of the economy, bringing down the price of goods and services for consumers nationwide. The potential for it to save money for both consumers and small businesses is the cherry on top. Two of the most effective methods for obtaining crude oil are oil rigs and offshore drilling, which is advantageous to the sector as a whole. China has established two world records in the field of deep-sea energy exploration. Now, the Shenlong-3, a self-development multifunctional modular seabed trencher from China, has been used to lay the country's first offshore pipeline project in Bangladesh, measuring more than 100 kilometers in length. Deep sea trenching behind the canal and sea land directional drilling have never been done before. The Belt and Road Initiative is the driving force behind this project. In order to avoid commercial and naval waterways, it also proposes for six directional drills to reach 11.9 meters underground. This is an unprecedented task in the history of world maritime engineering, according to Shenlong 3's designer. Additionally, the CPP's general manager, Zhu Fang, told China Media Group that the offshore industry already faces difficulties at a depth of 5 meters below the surface of the ocean. In addition, he said that the typical depth is between 1.5 and 3 meters. The Zhuangzi Drilling System Domestically created technology and apparatus for use in offshore oil and gas exploration have increased in production in China during the past few years. In addition, the country saw growth in the amount of money and people going to the sector. Finally, after 12 years of study and development, CNUKE's Zhuangzi was created. Combining logging while drilling LWD, and rotary steerable drilling RSD, is a method that can be used to effectively explore for oil and gas offshore. According to CNU, China's most fruitful offshore oil field is the Zhuangzi oil field. Furthermore, the system's accurate drill control allows for exact targeting of the oil layer from thousands of meters below the surface of the planet. Even more than a thousand meters of the 0.7 meter thin oil layer may be penetrated by the drill when it is remotely driven in this manner. Zhuangzi also has the ability to perform stratigraphic analysis in real time, and in certain ways this contributes to a reduction in the cost of oil and gas exploration. Additional maritime oil and gas resources may be developed more quickly and cheaply as a result. Since the one platform that fell 100 feet, China's offshore oil and gas exploration business has advanced. World's first, Shenhai-1 Six vessels with engineering skills for 3,000 meters below the surface have since been put into service in 2012. This occasion also signaled the start of China's rapid advancement of equipment for deep water oil and gas production. On June 25, 2021, Shenhai-1, a 100,000-ton semi-submersible platform for the production and storage of oil and gas off the coast of Hainan Province in China, started operating. The well generated more than 1 billion cubic meters of natural gas, according to its operator, CNUKE, on February 13. The Hai G-1, Asia's highest deep-water offshore jacket. The South China Sea received Hai G-1 on April 11. This Chinese-made deep-water jacket is the tallest in Asia, measuring a height of 302 meters. In the eastern South China Sea, 200 kilometers southeast of Hong Kong, the 30,000-ton Hai G-1 will be in operation. How do you feel about China's recent oil discovery? What do you think about the West's increasing fuel prices? Don't forget to comment below with your opinions on this. That's all. Thank you for watching. If you want to see more videos like this, press the bell icon and do not forget to like and subscribe.